we have four levels left. We struggled a little bit on level 28. And when I say a little bit, I mean it took us damn near two hours to get past it. Turns out I massively overcomplicated it, which I'm very good at doing with these levels. We're going to knock out these last four levels. This one is a gimmick level of some kind. So pretty much I'm not getting off the game until it's done. The final part of this Steam Ages is going bye-bye. Right here, right now. Let's do this. More blueprints and mole colonies. Great, thank you. User Dave, my scanners have picked up something noteworthy. The tunnels located below the yard are connected to a lot more than manholes. They span miles. Okay, why should I care? Because Zomboss has been sending more and more zombies in them. They are not just coming out of manholes, they are exploring. What will they even find down there? It's the sewers. Unless they're looking for that quarter I dropped in there unintentionally. They're looking for that mean ass shit that I did earlier. They're giving me one space per blueprint. Literally one space. And I can't, you see the mole colonies? I can't put anything on the manholes either. Oh, we got everything in this one. We got inventors, we got clockworks, we got furnaces, we got wheelbarrows, we got just about every annoying ass zombie they could possibly send. And don't forget the repair imp as well, hiding behind the, uh, the barrel there. My immediate thought is we need something super tanky on that one available space. And then something basically that can just kill it. We managed to get through day 28 in the end by using Homing Thistle. Now, Homing Thistle was one of the clutchest things. So that makes me kind of want to bring Homing Thistle right now. I'm definitely thinking we need... I'll tell you what, actually, I'm going to bring... What's like the bulkiest possible thing I could bring? Surely Tuna. Or do I just go for Caveman Johnny because I can replace them quickly if need be? We'll go for Caveman Johnny. We'll go for Caveman Johnny. They recharge quick. I can replace them. So we're going to Caveman Johnny right behind the blueprints and then jack lantern behind the manholes and i think we could be onto a winner if we can set this up properly see cattails are well and good but cattail i feel like recharges just a little bit too slowly and it has less range my like homing thistle basically can reach the zombies from anywhere on the map whereas cattail is not quite so generous even though it did get a damage buff Lovely jubbly. Let's give this a try. Jack o lantern go! Nice. That covers the whole mole colony. W idea, if I say so myself. Thank you. Give me more sun production, honestly. Get those numbers up. There we go. This is... See, that's exactly what I was concerned about. That's why I used the ghost pepper, but... Didn't go entirely as you planned. Now we just need to spam homing thistles. Is pretty much the play. Just mash them homing thistles. All of this, all of this, all of this. Homing thistle. And this is it. I think this is the strategy. Jack O'Lantern was a good call. I'm actually low key impressed with myself. Oh, that's bad. I need, I need a caveman. Johnny. There we go. That's it. Just in time. Drop that there. That might be okay. Yeah, definitely. Definitely want that. Just play it safe. Because ideally, we can start sort of moving all this a bit further up. Okay, now we drop that. Not really very worried about the blueprints, to be honest. Like, nothing that comes out of their manholes is getting anywhere near the blueprints. Without getting smoked by the jack-o'-lanterns. So I'm not even really worried about that. It's these clockwork fuckers. They're going to be death of me, I swear down. I'm gonna get rid of this homing thistle, and I'm gonna put another... Okay, that's not what's supposed to happen. Well, I'm through the jack-o'-lantern. That... I'm, I'm flipping, I'm panicking here. No, stop him. Stop him. God, we're not on final wave yet? Taking our time, lads. Oh, they're gonna reach a blueprint. Shit. They're gonna... Oh, I lost the jack-o'-lantern there. I wasn't paying attention! Nothing that comes out of their manholes is getting anywhere near the blueprints. Okay. That one's on me. That one's on me. <laughs> Go on, you can take middle lane as well. Go on, have it. Have at it. Have at it. I'm probably dead here anyway. Oh, jack-o'-lantern didn't fancy torching this one. Well... Oh, you, you recharge now! You recharge now! Maybe Jack O' Lantern isn't quite as reliable as I was hoping it was going to be for this one. Oh, don't tell me he's going to fucking reach that. 
Nope, not all the while there's a hole in my ass. No, thank you. Thank you, laser beam. Good shit. This is really hard to keep track of, though. I mean, like, really hard to keep track of. Come on. Another laser beam, please. Get a magnet room there. Okay, here's the thing. Torch this lane. Clutch mode! He's firing his laser. Oh. Well, that was going well until it wasn't. Cheers, Jeff. It might be okay. Might be okay here. We've, su we've officially survived the manholes. Get these magnet shrooms working already. Come on. Get them put to bloody work. I'm going to send this in the bottom lane just to... Yeah, there you go. There you go. And I think he's done it. At last. And we didn't have to use Grape Shot. Three levels to go. Survive the zombie. Oh, it's a PvZ3 level. Ooh, boy. Remember PvZ3, that game that's definitely still coming out? <laughs> it's definitely not. Thanks for giving me Winter Melon Pole after it's been nerfed. Appreciate that. Already we've got a barrel. Okay, do you know what? You're, you're getting a potato mine. You're getting a spadow potato mine. That's what you're getting. Is it, is it, is it going to activate? There you go. There you go. Blow his ass up. Get him out of here. I'm not looking too bad here. Oh, Garg, shit. Um, you exist. Huh. Drop a potato mine for you. Oh, boy. I forget. Did they do a thing in this mod? Did they do a thing in this mod where Hurricane doesn't work on Garg anymore? No, they didn't. Okay. What am I thinking of then? I'm thinking of the bully zombies. I'm thinking of the bully zombies. Hurricane doesn't work on them. Losing my sunflowers here. And I just realized that... Oh, hang on. Oh, we're definitely going to lose this one. Oh, we're definitely going to lose this one. I just realized we don't have sunflower in the, in the thing. Which means we have to not lose these... Uh, I have to not lose my sunflowers. Ah. I probably should have been putting more shit down then, shouldn't I? That probably would have been an idea. Actually, no, hang on. We've kind of... We're clinging on for dear life. A little bit. Bye bye. Oh, I don't know about that. Nice. That's a bit more like it. Drop one of these. Oh, 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 oh. Choices, choices. What happens if I plant food the electricity? I. Good question. I have no idea. I, I don't know what that did. I just need gentlemen. Do that so he jumps up. See you bye bye, the both of you. Show me the final wave. That's it. There we go. There we go. There we go. Let me see those words. There they are. Okay. I could just kick it and just do nothing. <laughs> I could just sit here. Chill out. <sighs> Good luck with that one, boys. Oh, the sunflower's are already gone. You can have the rest as well. Have at it. Don't mind me. It's all yours, mate. You can have the sun. You can have the Maypot mechanics. You can have the lot. Oh, yeah, the lawnmowers are still there. Oh, damn it. He foiled the plan. How could he? Oh, well. You get a present? What's in the box? Oh. Electric current. That plant that... Does, it, does anyone use electric current, honestly? Two levels left. How the hell are we getting past all this? We got everything. And I mean, like, absolutely everything. I'd recommend bringing plants that kill the zombies. Thank you, mate. I'll try that. Thanks for the recommendation. You said repeat a torchwood? Surely that ain't gonna work. Repeat a torchwood ain't worked since, like, PVZ1. There's absolutely no shot this works. But what? I'll, I'll try it. Go ahead. We'll, we'll do repeat a torchwood. This is going to die. We also don't have anything to attack these manholes. We, let's let's just do it. Repeat a torchwood. This this is for the nostalgia. This is for old times. There's just not a good place to set anything up. Just because of where they put these manholes.
by George. This is definitely carrying us through this level. Definitely don't see how this one could fail. Stack the torchwoods? Can you do that? Hold on. I gotta try this. Holy fuck, you can stack the torchwoods. This is new information. Do that, then it blows up and kills him. There we go. I did not know you could stack the torchwoods. Still doesn't seem to be killing anything in a hurry, though, is the only problem. Oh, actually, you know, he died somewhat convincingly. What is chewing on what right now? Oh, there was an imp there. I didn't even see it. Stack these torchwoods, bro. Stack them. Stack them, stack them, stack them. I don't even know why I'm sitting here as if this is actually going to win. Garg's still alive. <laughs> oh, just kill him. I don't care. How the hell are we, like, halfway through this? Seriously. How have we survived this long? Big plane coming. Okay, that wasn't as good. No, that was terrible. I did that way too early. I actually fucked that. So I fucked that up so badly. No, I don't want that imp taking my shit out. No. I'm having to use time warp to save me from the imps being thrown and anything coming out of the manholes. Like, that's actually unironically the strategy right now. Ready for another torture when he hits that one? Another one. More damage. And now problems. Much, much problems. And that. Oh, I could really use another time warp right about now. But I ain't gonna get one. This is where it falls apart. This is where it falls apart. I kind of want to see how many torchwoods you can stack. I will kind of just let myself die here a little bit. But I want to try stacking torchwoods. Just for a bit of fun. It stacks at least three times. Imagine it stacks a fourth time. Am I even going to get to find out? Am I going to get the sun in time? I don't think so. No. I got my shit kicked in, but that we've been armed with some interesting information. Yeah, no. No, I don't think this is the one. Cute idea. Cute idea. But it would have taken far too long to set this up. Lacking an answer for Gargantua. Ooh, bad feeling about this. Okay, find a clutch. Not yet, not yet on the blover, not yet on the blover. Not yet, not yet, not yet, not yet. Not yet. Might not even be necessary. We're hitting final wave. Are we going to survive? Mate, I got a free lightning power up and I ain't afraid to use it. There's still the issue of top lane and bottom lane. Oh, God. No. No, we're going to need someone else. We're going to need someone else. It's the Gargs. It's literally the Gargs. Other than that, we were good. Like, the cactus was actually working. You dead or are you... No, you want a shrinking violet? Absolutely fine. And then a little bit of the kaboom. Uh, I wish this repair imp thing would go away. It's a bit annoying. Here comes final. We have all the mowers. But that we're not out of the woods just yet. We're not out of the woods just yet. Big shrinking violet coming up. Shrink everyone's dicks to like less than half an inch. Half an inch is not small enough. Chad there. Oh, wait, you destroyed it. Shit, that's not good. Uh, well, in that case, I raise you to squash. Can't destroy that. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. There we go. Victory at last. We move. One level left.
I mean, unless they're planning on making even more worlds for this mod, this is actually the end of Reflourish. The proper end. <laughs> Oh, they're setting the tone. Oh, they're setting the tone with this one. <laughs> this is it. It's going to be conveyor belt, which means they're going to give us the tools. I won't have to pick for this one. Because Lord knows if we've learned anything by now, it's that you should not trust me to do that. Good day, chaps. Do you or do you not enjoy the presence of Penny, the camping van? Blimey, I sure hope so. For if you do, you support the mechanical inventions brought on by the sweat of labor. In turn, you should stop to consider which of those were developed before I arrived here. How advanced, if so? You must stop and admit, my endeavors often produce more good than harm. Get your noggins working. Barmy nitwits. Here it comes. That's a, that's a nice little mech you got there. Four bars. Let's do it. Oh, I'm straight away, I'm thinking. We hit one of these. Okay, I was kind of hoping that could maybe kill him, but such is life. All right, they're going to go backwards. Ah, okay. Oh, what does this one do again? I don't even remember what this one does. Another cat tail, we'll get these at the back. So they can run some good defense. Oh, that's the alchemy lily thing. Um, we're going to hit that. Wow, clutch. Okay, save this, save this, save this. Save the electricity for the gentleman. Say it with me. The alchemy lily makes them take more damage, doesn't it? I think. I think that's how that works. God, I really don't like how he keeps doing that. Wait for him to move. Wait for him to move. Wait for him to move. Move to a different lane. Boy, move to a different lane. Now. No. That's it. That's the one. Now we hit him. Big damage coming up. Look at that. First bar. Deleted. Bucketheads forever remain a pain in my ass. That's it. The Lotus Flyer's a good use. Don't like this top lane. Don't like that one bit. Do one of these ones. Big damage again. Fish, bash, bosh. We're going to have to hit that. Why would you not go for the ones directly in front of you? What is wrong with you? I don't want to plant food any of the... Uh... I don't want to plant food any of the Maypops. They're going to just die. We're going to try this again, Cattail. I give up. You actually can't get the staff around here. Or the kittens. Okay, we saved the mower. We saved the mower. The mower's not dead. We're almost halfway here. We're almost halfway. Last chance, Cattail. Last chance. Better! That's a bit more like it. See, I knew you had it in you. Was I really asking for sparkling? I must have been asking for champagne. There we go. Garg's dead. Right. Go on. I don't know why I keep putting my faith in you. Thank you. W cattail for once. Now let's do it again. Yep. They're not dying, though. That's the problem. Oh, these fucking gargs. Why do they have to be two in the same lane? That is so satanic. How are you going to put two in the same lane? One's dead. I am trying so hard to just keep this thing in place right now. It walks straight past that. Fuck! Oh, I don't know. He's getting down to his last bar. But now they're starting to send shitloads in those other lanes. And that's... Oh, fuck me. Oh, this is so bad. Oh, we've done so well. We've done so well. We've come this far. Don't tell me this is where we die. I think we could be very swiftly on the way to death. Garg died. But that top lane is dead as fuck. Yep, 
yeah, that is the deadest top lane I have ever seen. Just when the music hit as well. Well, we got to listen to it for like half a second. Big damage. Come on. Okay. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Zomboss move. Zomboss move. I swear to God, bro. Come on. No, what? He ate all of that? You're kidding. Bro, he just ate the whole lot. He just ate the whole fucking lot. Okay, not good, not good, not good. I really needed that magnet shroom to work. I don't have an answer for this. I don't have an answer for this. I don't have an answer for this. Good electricity. This is looking a little better. Don't like my cattails dying though. What to do, cattail? What the fuck were you aiming at? You actually going for Zomboss? You gotta be. Do you know what? That, I think, officially wraps it up for Steam Ages Part 2. All 16 levels done. Yeah, that definitely didn't take me like two entire streams to get done, but Christ in heaven. That was good though. That was, honestly, that expansion was worth waiting for. Like, some of the levels in that were so difficult. But like, I'm impressed. I'm very impressed. Like, they already had some crazy difficult levels in this mod, but I think... That second part of Steam Ages had some of the hardest ones. So do you know what? Worth coming back to. Now, we have obviously taken quite a lengthy hiatus from PBZ. We came back to do this. I know a lot of you want to know. Is this it? Are we leaving again? Or what are we doing? 